My name is Robert Holm and I'm the Ag Agent here in Collier County. This is the first morning of our tour and what we're trying to do is make sure that people that don't know anything about agriculture learn as much as possible and the people that do know about agriculture in other states learn about agriculture in Collier County. We'll be visiting several farms today, both large and small, so they can see the difference between the two. My name is Alex Salazar. I'm the operations manager of American Farms. I welcome you all to our facility. When the summer comes and people go to a garden center, we have been already working three and four months ahead and sometimes even six months ahead of time so you can have the plans for the season. To make sure that we generate, you know, a very strong root system so when this plant gets on the final container, it really takes off. Hello, I'm Andrew Hahn and welcome to Roy Betty Nursery. Uh, I'm the manager of Roy Betty Nursery and we specialize in pineapple plants. I'm talking from experience. I grew food one way for 25 years and I've grown it another way for another 20 years. And uh, I, I can tell you, you guys got to look into it. It, 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 it. It's just all simple logic. If, if your diet is wrong, your medicine will not work. If your diet is right, you do not need your medicine. Uh, in, in, in the Western philosophy, uh, 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 Hippocrates said, let your medicine be your food, let your food be your medicine. Kind of the same thing. This, if, if any of us can get a little closer, you can see, we, we, you can see all those worms. Yeah, yeah, this is vermiculture. And, and happily, we have time, everything that humans have ever done to food, everything, we lessen it nutritionally. I don't think there's ever been a time, no one can prove to me, uh, or, or has even tried to, that we have ever made any food more nutritious than Nature gives it to us. Well, we are Sanctuary Nursery, and my wife Betsy and I, Harold, and we work all the time here since like three years. And we have another nursery where we started like four years ago uh, on Everglades. And we make woody ornamentals and we like a lot what flowering stuff is. That's why you see so many colors here. And well, we like plants. That's why we are in this business. A jar like this will cost you hundred dollars. Yeah. But gel is very good because it stakes, sticks, so it will be better. And then basically what we do is, from here it goes in the mist house. And then it goes away again. 10 minutes again and it will do so. This is the way that we propagate most of the plants that you see here. Except like by seeds. Seeds normally are done for grasses and for 
like other plants. Whether this will also root, but it takes longer because it's harder here because the tree, like now it's spring, what happened? All the hormones that are, the old hormones that are inside, they go to the top to grow. So that's why we use this part basically, this part for propagation. So 